Hello, I'm Pastor Chris Sansom, and today I'm going to teach you how to robe up in being an acolyte here at St. Mark's Lutheran This Church. is one of the items that I get the most questions about. Oftentimes it is the first thing forgotten after acolyte training, and so I tend to go over this a lot. So, let's get started, shall we? The first thing we have is what's called an alb, which is a white robe. It's a white robe. And we put it on. And the first question I often get has to do with the Velcro. The alb has two sets of Velcro. Some for the inside of the robe, some to fasten the outside. The first one is the inside. It goes all the way around on the inside of the alb. All right, there's also one on the bottom here that keeps the bottom part of the robe in place. After that, the top piece can go back all the way around uh, the neck here onto the shoulder. And then the bottom one as well. And there we have it, the all. Next is this rope thing. This is called a censure. That's what the rope is called. And what we do is we take a rope and we basically split it in half, put the two knots together, bring it all the way up, and that will create a loop here on the back end. So what we do with that is we, we open the loop and we fit the thing through. And this creates kind of a, a notch, you might say, or, or something. And then after that, wrap it around. We fit the other two parts of the knot into that, and then we tighten. Now, the big question, where does the knot go now? Um, there are some people that would argue that the knot would actually go on the left side if you're a pastor and a right side if you're an acolyte. Personally, I'm just not that nitpicky, so either one will do. But this center is a little long, and while you can't see it on the video, it actually goes all the way down to my feet, which might become a tripping hazard. And so, we so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take this part, and I'm going to put it up, and I'm going to put it on the belt part of the center, uh, kind of the place that's tight, uh, and that's going to create kind of a loop, and that way it doesn't get in the way of my feet, and I can walk uh, around the chancel and around the church without having to worry about the length of my censure. I hope this has been informative for you, and uh, I hope you're able to view this and uh, to learn more about how to, well, wear an all and, and tie a censure. Thank you, and God bless us.